in terms of the expo, you're here at the All Max booth, right? Yeah. And uh, I saw Amanda at the uh, Meet the Olympians yeah, uh, the yeah, other day. She, she's and, here uh, with me. So she, she's here with uh, Booty Queen? Uh, we actually, we're here with All Max. We, we were going to have a, a Booty Queen booth, but we're, I'm, we're so hands on in what, like our business that, you know, she's like maybe not so good with you competing, too much stress. And knowing me, like I know I'd be wanting to be involved and be like, hey, what's going on with that? I'm, but I need to be focused on getting on stage and bringing my best. So Smart. we decided to pull the pull the plug on having a booth this year. Maybe next year we'll have more staff and more people. Well, I will say that my wife is a huge fan <laughs> of, of her, her products. She loves those pants. So thank uh, you. And it's cool to see, you know, the fans that are here. Like not only the people that are fans of the sport are big, or hey, I seen you guys on Shark Tank. So that's, that's yeah. pretty cool too. So besides winning tonight, what's on your agenda for the for uh, Steve Kugel of the future? Uh, you know, I think definitely absorbing and uh, enjoying the, of what happened this weekend for me, it's definitely going to be something I, I'm, I'm going to spend some time with friends and family and enjoy the moment. Um, take some time, enjoy some time. My wife, take her on vacation because I know she needs it yeah. more than I do, but <laughs> she needs a vacation. Uh, she's absolutely amazing. My wife's incredible inside and out, and she's she's my biggest support through it all. You know, and I got such a huge. I probably have 30 plus people out here, friends and family, that come out to Olympia nice. every year, and it's it's awesome to see the support I have. I actually got emotional yesterday because of the amount of love and support I get, and and I see them in the audience, and we we hang out after, and it's. They come over all over the U.S. to come, you know, see me, and yeah. it's like, man, that's awesome. So, like, talk to me about tonight, right? So, you had, you obviously made a great impression on the judges last night. Yeah. How do you, how do you get ready for tonight, and what do you plan to bring to, to, to stand out and to really keep keep the motive? Motiv 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 you know, a, a lot of going. Uh, most guys usually look better on Saturday. I think the nerves are down a little bit. You're kind of able to take a little bit of a deep breath. Think, okay, a lot of the judging is done, but. There's still judging to be done tonight, and there's still routines, and there's still the, the stuff that we have to do to, to show everything, improve your placing. And then if not, maybe move up a couple spots. I mean, that's still an option. Yeah. So it for is. me, it's it's um, just kind of keep on course, trying not to do anything crazy, trying to make some little refinements. You know, I looked at some photos last night and said, okay, this is what we can improve. Let's tweak a few poses. But, you know, because until you're on that stage and see that lighting and and the guys you're with and, and how to make yourself look a little bit better. It's good to see photos and, I, and I'm, a, I'm a critic of myself and I take, you know, a critique's really important as well. So um, the, all the combo, all that, I think we're gonna really bring it in tonight and just shine. I got one more question. Please, bring it. What is the cheat meal of choice that's gonna happen? You know what, I, I, I've, I've spent my years with some killer cheat meals after shows and- uh, Now you calmed it down a little bit? And I've calmed it down, I've good. learned my lesson because yeah. you know, <laughs> we, we've ate the same thing for months on end to, uh, going into this. And as soon as you throw a little a wrench in that, like, it feels like somebody just punched you in the stomach and said, that shit ain't working. Smoking like a true veteran. Yeah. Smoking like a true veteran. But for me, um, it's kind of funny. People are like, what do you want? What do you want to get that a lot? And I said, honestly, I want a shower. I want a cold drink like a Gatorade. Yeah. And usually something like cold fruit or, or something yeah. like that because it's sweet. Yeah. And it's, uh, it, it, you know, it's juicy and you, it kind of hydrates you. And right. After being in the desert for a couple of days with nearly no water, I mean, like water is probably the only thing I'm craving right now. Oh, good for you. <laughs> well, listen, it's such an honor having you in here, man. Thank yeah, you, man. Like I said, really we've been fans. It's exciting to see someone who's been working really hard start getting there, man. Thank so, you. Thank can you, you also let everyone know where they can find you, social media handles? Yeah, better. everything is just my name at, at Steve Kuklo through uh, Instagram, Facebook. Um, you know, I've, I've been pretty active uh, this last week, few weeks, you know, because there's a lot of traffic. I think people love seeing what's going on. And social media yeah. offers that ability for fans to to interact with us on a deeper level yeah. uh, to see what's going on with prep and, and what you're doing. And like this last week, I've kind of did a video every day leading up to uh, the show and, and kind of where I'm at, how I'm feeling. And, and people really, the feedback of the fans have been awesome and the support well, and everything. It's good because it shows them that you're not just, you're not a zombie that trains, sleeps, gets up and trains. You, you're a person that you have to deal with all this other stuff too. And it's, right, right. it does help, you know, get those new fans into the sport and also, you know, new fans of your brand as well. And where can they find uh, where can they find the clothing? Uh, the clothing? Yeah, uh, bootyqueenapparel.com for all you girls out there that are watching that are fans uh, or guys that need to buy a gift for your girl. You can't go wrong buying her a pair of leggings. I mean, every girl loves a nice pair of quality leggings. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Well, well Steve, Steve I heard a lot so of much, great man. things about you. Zach said you're a great dude. Thank you. Happy man. to have Thank you in here, man. Absolutely. Best of luck. It's people. awesome, yeah. man. You yeah. guys can't wait to awesome, see you tonight, man. man. We'll be, we'll both be there. Let's do it. If you guys are out there watching and be at the show, I want to hear you.